To perform the system calibration on your new VPXL, you will need the following. One microliter microcaps, a pair of tweezers, a small supply of purified or deionized water, and sample bottles, caps, and septa. All of these items can be purchased through Arizona Instrument. See the description below for more details. To begin, select the test that you wish to perform and allow the instrument to reach the necessary temperature. Begin by tipping the tube of one microliter microcaps upside down and shaking gently until a single capillary comes out. Shake it out over the cap of the bottle you will use for the test to make it easier to pick up in the next step. Gently pick up the capillary with your tweezers and just barely dip one of its ends into the water. Tilting the microcap slightly can help the water fill the capillary and can help you see the water level as it's being filled. If you're unable to see the water level, try filling over a black background. If you're still unable to see whether or not the tube is filled, simply hold the end of the capillary in the water for 10 to 15 seconds to ensure that it is filled. Remove the end of the capillary from the water and wipe away any excess water that remains on the sides of the tube with your fingers or a chem wipe. Be careful to avoid touching the ends of the tube as this can cause some of the water to escape. Gently place the capillary into your sample bottle. It's best to do this horizontally rather than vertically to avoid dropping the capillary and allowing some of the water to escape. Put the cap on the bottle and, if the microcap is not centered, gently shake the bottle until it is in place. Place the bottle on the transport with the cap side toward the instrument. Hit the test button in the middle bottom of the touchscreen and follow the on-screen instructions. Testing times range from three to seven minutes for each one microliter microcap. Once you have three test results that are within 50 micrograms of each other and fall within the range of 950 micrograms to 1,050 micrograms, you can perform statistical analysis on the results. Follow the on-screen prompts to perform the analysis. If the standard deviation is less than 50 and the coefficient of variation is less than five, the instrument does not need to be recalibrated. If your results do not fall within those requirements, you will need to perform a system calibration. Simply select the test results you wish to use to perform the calibration and hit Calibrate. We recommend that you perform statistical analysis using at least three test results once a week and perform a one microliter test each day that you plan on using the instrument. This helps verify that the instrument is functioning properly. For more help regarding filling the capillary tubes to perform a system calibration or RH sensor verification test, or for answers to any other questions, visit us online or contact us via the links in the description below.